Matthew 26 to 2, for KJV know that after two days is the feast of the Passover, and the Son of Man is betrayed to be crucified, and consulted that they might take Jesus by subtlety and kill him. Matthew 27 to 23 KJV and the governor said, Why, what evil hath he done? But they cried out the more, saying, Let him be crucified. Matthew 27 to 35, 50 KJV and they crucified him, and parted his garments, casting lots, that it might be fulfilled which was spoken by the prophet, they parted my garments among them, and upon my vesture did they cast lots. Jesus, when he had cried again with a loud voice, yielded up the ghost. Our hearts goes at this point in time to those who have been victims of satanic deception. Under the guise of transgendering from their natural human self dot to the opposite sex, by being butchered and reconstructed into a new life of total wreck. To Peter 316-17 KJV as also in all his epistles, speaking in them of these things, in which are some things hard to be understood, which they that are unlearned and in stable rest, as they do also the other scriptures, unto their own destruction. Ye therefore, beloved, seeing ye know these things before, beware lest ye also, being led away with the error of the wicked, fall from your own steadfastness, the error of wickedness on innocent souls originate from the pit of hell. Ask any transgender, months and years after the reconstruction of their bodies, is a wholesome disastrous testimony of regrets, yet, some are still submitting themselves to subtle lies by those entrusted with their health. May you and your loved ones not be victims. A final and eternal sacrifice has been paid on the cross of Calvary. Do no longer surrender yourself to the blade and knife human blood sacrifice. Your life is too valuable and precious to God for you to be deceived. Enjoy your Easter holidays e-o-d!